Hello everybody, welcome back to Let's Play Persona 4. In the last episode we had the hilariousness that is Mystery Food X, which is... I swear to God, it really is the best cutscene in this game. And in this episode we're going to continue on with the camp. The school camp, and we're going to go into... And, and look at look at our awesome tent with Kanji in here. Damn it, I'm so hungry. Um, I'm sorry, Yosuke. And no, we need to do that tonight. And how the hell did you end up here? My teach threatened to hold me back a year if I didn't show. And the first year's tent is all quiet. It's like someone died. <laughs> well, if you were in there with him, I'm not surprised. Is it just you two in this tent? Of course. So Soji and Yosuke were, of course, going to sleep together, obviously. Why? Why, why would you ask that question? The other guys called in sick. Smart move. Yeah, because they would have died. So it's okay if I hang out here? Yeah, it's, it's, I don't care. Hey, you're a stand-up guy, senpai. Hey, you're awesome, Kanji. Don't worry, I won't make any trouble for you. They won't catch me unless we raise a ruckus. All right, all right, you can sleep over there. Dude, there's a huge rock under there. How am I supposed to sleep? It's gonna hurt like hell. Pipe down! Didn't you say you weren't gonna make any noise? Yo, senpai, can't you go just a little further back? Nope. There's a slope just past here. I'd roll down the hill in my sleep. Uh, how are you gonna roll down the hill? The tent would stop you. If you don't like it here, go back to the first year tent. Hey, wasn't your teacher some guy called King Moron? And he is a King Moron. That guy stopped me outside earlier and he pissed me off so bad I was about to lose it. He was going on and on about when I was in middle school. When he doesn't know shit about any of that. Not only that, he was bullshitting about how I'll be expelled immediately if I cause trouble. That ain't funny, man. Yeah, that guy set a speed record for jumping to conclusions. <laughs> Check this out, right? I heard it from a guy in my class. He said that asshole was talking shit about the two girls who died. He was. King Moron was talking about Ms. Yamano and Saki-senpai? It was like, it's no surprise that people who are unfaithful or run away from home meet a bad end. I don't know, maybe he was exaggerating. Everyone seems to hate that son of a bitch Moraoka. Damn, I could just picture him saying that. I hate him, I really do. He never shut up about me either when I moved here last year. Not that I remember anything he said. <laughs> Even if it's only a little true, it still pisses me off. The dickhead's a damn teacher, for God's sake. Where the hell did you get those chips, Yosuke? Nah, don't waste your energy getting pissed at that clown. Yeah, you got a point. Wait a sec. What are you eating? Animal crackers? Oh, they're animal crackers. What the? Those are mine! Damn it! I was so pumped about finding the penguin today. Penguin? Penguin? <laughs> Got the same reaction though, Yosuke. The secret animal cracker! You were eating them and you didn't know that? Nope. Are you serious? Well, you should have said something. Oh well. Oh, this isn't gonna fill me up. Let's just go to sleep. That's all you gotta say for yourself after taking my snacks. <laughs> yes. Kanji, don't you have more space on your side? Everyone looks comfortable just as they are. Shut up. And I can't sleep over there, or my back's gonna break. Oh, okay. Soji, you can just move closer. Uh, hey. Just move closer to Yosuke, Soji. It'll be just. It'll be fine. We're gonna be fine. Yeah? Why'd you come to this tent? <laughs> I already told you. Jeez, wrong with you. 
this is as good a time as any, so I want you to be honest with us. Uh, okay. Are you really, you know? Am I really what? What I mean is, um, are we going to be safe alone with you? I love the camp. What? What the hell is that supposed to mean? I already told you guys I'm not like that. Well, then why are you all hot and bothered about it? You're gonna get caught. That's just more suspicious. Hell no! We settled this already, damn it. Right now I'm... Well... How do I put it? Uh... Oops. Oh god, don't trail off like that! You're freaking me out! I'm trying to tell you that I have no problem being around girls now. Can you prove it? <laughs> prove it? <laughs> oh, I like this scene too. Because if you can't, we're going to be stuck here all night, half scared to death. <laughs> to hell with this. If that's what you really think of me, then I'm going to go hit the girls' tent right now. Um... Wait, well that's a little extreme. You don't have to go that far. They'll expel you if they find you. Don't tell me you forgot. King Moron's got his eye on you. Yeah, like that stop a man like me. You man. The dude's seriously going for it. Hey man, you gotta stop him! <laughs> uh, uh, the... <laughs> if you say don't do this, you get expression for the last two, but mine's maxed out. So, uh, I'm gonna say go get him, because it'll be funny. Hell yeah! Now you'll see. To hell with King Moron! No one's stopping Kaji Tatsumi, damn it! Uh, hey, wait! Bye. What a putz. I declare myself not responsible for anything that happens. Me too. Even though I told him to go back, go get him. So, I, I am kind of responsible. If I, if I told him to stop, he would have done it anyway, so, you know. <laughs> oh, meanwhile, I'm inside of what of us. Ah, uh, now I get why we're the only three in here. I can't sleep. Oh, I'm hungry, too. That was your fault, stupid. I should have eaten a little more of that curry. <laughs> Couldn't you guys just eat the rice? I mean, like, curry is rice and uh, the sauce. Could you just eat the rice instead? It might have knocked us unconscious. As long as you didn't mix the rice and the curry together, which you're not supposed to do. You're supposed to put the rice on the plate and put the curry sauce on top of the rice. If you threw the rice in the curry sauce, I'm going to kick you girls because you girls are stupid. Sheesh, we can't sleep, we can't walk around. I wonder what Teddy's doing right now. Chilling on the TV. Being alone all day is pretty rough when you think about it. You know, a while ago he... <sighs> that does it! Yukiko, we're out of here! Where'd we go, though? I don't think climbing down the mountain is a good idea. Do you think she'd stop snoring if I covered her nose and mouth? I think she'd suffocate. <sighs> no, 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 I can't take it anymore. Whoa, who's there? <sighs> I love this game. Back at Yahiko and Yosuke's tent. Oh. My phone went off. Hey, are you guys still up? What are you doing here? This is the guy's side! Let us in! Don't be ridiculous! If King Moron finds out, we'll all be expelled! Go back to your tent! We can't! Are there any rotten apples out and about? Any? Indecent students out there? 
All right, hurry up and get in. So why are you two here? Well, it's Kanji-kun. Oh, hi. Kanji. Sounds fun. He's out cold. <laughs> why? Uh, I don't know what happened. He just came in and then and then, and then he fainted all of a sudden. Oh. That's all. Right, Yukiko? Really? Huh? Uh, yeah. So there was no way we could sleep with him lying there. And, and you know, if, if we woke him up, he might have made a fuss. That's why we left him there. What? That makes no sense. He busted into your tent, then suddenly fainted. Listen up! Being insolent and being indecent are very different things! Shut up, you drunk bastard. It's him! He's right outside! Hey, turn the light off! You can sense King Moron getting closer. Hey! Are you two in there? Answer me! <laughs> uh... I think either way, he kinda gets him out of you. If you say we're not here, he thinks... I don't know. I mean, he'll just yell at us for not being asleep. Huh? Ah, so you're in there. Is Hanamura already asleep? Yes, sir! Fast asleep, sir! <laughs> Don't get cute, Hanamura! Shut up and go back to sleep! Yeah, because that was, you know, cute, right? <sighs> Ugh. I think I had one too many. I'm so sleepy. Shut up and sleep, stupid. But not in here. Because Chi will kick you and knock you out like he did, she did to Kanji, obviously. <sighs> there goes a couple years off my lifespan. Um, I'm pretty sure going into the TV world and killing monsters probably takes a couple years off your lifespan, too. No joke. We were nearly expelled. Hey, this is you guys' fault. Well, what else were we supposed to do? Anyways, we can't leave now. We'll sneak out before the others wake up tomorrow. Is that good enough for you? Yeah, sure. What are you so pissed off for? Hey, you better not try any funny stuff while we're asleep. Is that clear? Shut up and sleep. Hey, we didn't say you could... Damn it. You owe us for this. You girls are ruining this trip, man. But it's hilarious. You set up a barricade so the you just get everyone's belongings. You spend the night cramped up in a tight space. Yeah. <laughs> it's funny, though. I love the camp. I really do. It's the best part of the game. The next day, the students were all dismissed in the morning. Looks like we're the only ones here! What's wrong? Got a stomachache? No, it's just... I thought I got pissed and ran out of the tent last night. It's so weird. Was it a dream? I woke up. I was in Yosuke's senpai's tent. I, I... I was a dream. It must have been a dream. Okay. <laughs> Alright then, let's get swimming. Are you seriously taking a swim? I'll pass. I'm still all stiff. Yeah, I'm getting kicked in the face. What are you looking at us for? If you guys want to swim, go right ahead. No, you guys are going in too. You know, you two still owe us. Huh? Whoa, 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 we are not going in there. I mean, we do owe you, but, uh... Uh, uh oh yeah! We don't have swimsuits with us. Man, of all the luck... Don't worry. You also came prepared. Yeah, it really is unfortunate. Oh, I see how it is. We put up with your dinner, we save you from King Moron, and you won't even have some fun with us in the river. No, 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 
it's it's really too bad. It'd be no problem if I just had a swimsuit now. <laughs> Broski has got you covered. Ta-da! I've got you covered! Haha, <laughs> we do the same thing. Yosuke, you and me think alike. They're Juness brand originals from our brand new line of swimwear that just came in for the summer. I had a clerk friend of mine choose them for me. Pretty swanky, huh? Dude, that's just wrong. In what way? I don't see how that's wrong. Did you have those this whole time? I bet he did. Come on, let's all go swimming! What should we do, Yukiko? Jump in the damn river, obviously. Look at the rainbow in the back, I didn't even notice that. It'd be no problem if I just had a swimsuit! That was the worst impression ever, Yosuke. Uh... You know, we really were looking forward to dinner. Just rub it in. Mm. I wonder what would have happened if we didn't help you guys last night. But we get it already. Sheesh, never let things go. He just wants to see you girls in sexy swimsuits. Obviously. Alright, that's more like it. Woo! Yeah! How far off did those two go to get changed? Come on, let's get in. Ta-da! Whoa! Man! Stop staring like that! Stare more, it's funny. Hey! Uh, yeah, you two, you two look cute, I guess. I don't know. I mean, depending on who you choose, it, it, I think it, if you choose one person over the other, they kind of like you more, but... I don't know, I'm just gonna go with both of them because I don't really care. W where did that come from? Magic. They both seem embarrassed. Man, this is going even better than I expected! Kinda makes up for having to eat that mystery food X last night. And come on, you guys got to admit I chose some good suits. Those girls might be childish on the inside, but I bet they're gonna turn into some fine-looking women before too long. <laughs> Don't you think so? <laughs> oh, sure. That pushes into the river, it's funny. You guys cross the line. Definitely. Whoosh. <laughs> It's freezing! You didn't have to push us in! Who cares? You were going in the river anyway. They brought this on themselves! Sheesh! Aren't they the worst, Kanji-kun? Hey, you've been awful quiet. Are, are you feeling okay? Don't tell me the injuries from yesterday are still... Injuries? Uh... Yeah, she's not more conscious. What? <laughs> Kanji has a no sleep. Ew! Push. <laughs> that was close. <laughs> oh man. What? what was that for? I didn't do anything. Hey, what's gotten into you? Do you hear something uh, over there? Really long. I didn't want to end it right before the scene, though. <laughs> Here, man, heaving upstream. Oh, lovely. Seems like King Moron is vomiting further up the river. So that's why no one else was here. Good thing we noticed before we went in. Vomit River, get out. Senpai. Don't say it. Get out of the vomit river! You feel as though a million showers will never make you clean. Get out! <laughs> ah, how was the school camp? Oh, it was hilarious. Alright, that'll be it for this episode. And the school camp, sadly, because it was hilarious. So thanks everybody for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!